What's up guys? Welcome to another Build It Break Garage episode. Today's episode, I'm not 100% sure what we're going to be doing, but uh, I'm going to catch you guys up on everything that's been happening in the past couple months. So as you obviously can tell, it's been a couple months since my last post. What's up guys? So I just wanted to interject here real quick before this video gets started. This video was months ago. It was filmed back in August, and it's currently December, or well, it's November 25th actually, and I'm just now getting around to editing it. My life has changed quite a bit, and videos were kind of put on the back burner for a while, so uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. It's been months in the making. Hope to continue to shoot videos. Uh, granted, they're probably not going to be as often as you guys would like, but at least you guys keep up to date. Um, I don't expect the channel to grow too much in the past couple months, or the next couple months, but at least uh, you guys can enjoy this. So, enjoy. So, I last told you guys that I was getting laid off, and I was going to have a lot more time to focus on the channel more. Well, it turned out I ended up going to a different shift, and that made it so it was super difficult for me to uh, get used to everything, and I also had to... Uh, modify my sleep schedule and it was a big life change so the videos kind of went on the back burner for a little bit but now I'm back we are this is only uh, or we're two weeks away from the Woodward Dream Cruise so it's gonna be a car pack couple weeks here so I figured why not now to start it back up and get you guys all caught up to speed so the last time you guys saw Midori she had different wheels these are the new Rota Slipstreams in 17s. I got them brand new. We got new tires and everything. Uh, I absolutely like love how the car looks now. You can't go wrong with Rota Slips and especially in white on Midori Green. The car's been running fantastic. I've had zero issues with the turbo. It, um, it's been doing really good. Uh, we've, I've, been, I've put a crap ton of miles on it this summer already. Uh, I've been driving it every opportunity I get. I mean, it gets horrible gas mileage, or E85, but it, uh, it's so worth it to drive it. I absolutely love this car. Today, uh, I'm going to start off by getting it all cleaned up because it is an absolute mess right now. But I am filming this on my lunch break, so I'm going to end up putting you guys down, and then uh, I'll come back to you guys after I get off work, and then we're going to wash this car up and get it all nice and clean for this weekend because we have a couple of different shows to go to. And here's a cold startup on Midori. gone by got off work had a good day uh, so now I'm gonna get the car all cleaned up got her outside got all the windows up get ready to foam her down and scrub a dub dub she's all uh, uh, dirty from the rain that I ran through on Sunday so I'm gonna get it all cleaned up the wheels yeah enjoy watching me wash the car And just like that, she is nice and clean. Now I'm gonna go take her for a spin around the block really quick so I get the wheels all dried off and then uh, bring it in the garage and start polishing it up. Uh, there was actually a grease uh, grease mark on the side of the car. I must've ran over some uh, tar or something. Uh, I didn't even see it until I started washing it. So it's a good thing I actually washed it and got that off. So now I'm gonna get the car in the garage and start polishing up the wheels. Okay, just like that, the car is all nice and clean, and uh, the tires and wheels are all nice and spotless, so I'm glad for that. Yeah, so that's it for today. Uh, this video is probably not going to be long enough to make one video, so I'm going to jump to tomorrow, and we are going to a car show, so I'll see you guys then. We are at Friday now. Uh, I've got Roadkill Nights to go to tonight. Uh, right now I'm on lunch break from work, just clocked out, so I need to go fill this bitch up with some E85 really quick. Uh, just in case we get caught in traffic, I got a half tank and this car eats through gas even idling. So I'll uh, check it with you guys at the gas station.
uh, this thing gets about nine miles to a gallon, so it's really shitty. I'm gonna hit you guys up once uh, I get out of work and head on down to Roadkill. So hopefully it's a good event tonight. The weather looks like it's gonna be perfect. Uh, we're meeting Danette at the track, so uh, we're gonna probably give her a ride uh, the car tonight. So it should be a pretty good day. So stay tuned and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hi guys, well, I got off work and uh, I'm about to head to Roadkill Nights at M1 Concourse. So, uh, yeah, uh, sit back and, then, uh, well, I would film the ride, but uh, I don't have my GoPro with me. I don't feel like grabbing it either, so I'll uh, check in with you guys once I actually get in the gates and uh, start seeing some cars. Well, guys, we made it to the track. As you can see behind me, they are already doing the ride along. We'll get some footage of that real quick and then uh, run you guys through the car, sh car show. <laughs> All these cars are for the drag racing uh, for tomorrow. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, they're all really high horsepower rear wheel drive cars, so I'm gonna assume that that's the case. So I'm gonna ride around the show and I'll show you guys if I find anything interesting. Well, guys, I'm not gonna lie, there's not a whole lot going on, especially since they're not doing drag racing today. Uh, basically just a thrill ride event, so I'm gonna go sit around and kind of surf the web a little bit. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I'll have to check in with you guys later to see if uh, anything starts interesting happening, because right now I'm kind of bored. But yeah, see you guys in a little bit. All right, well, the uh, general consensus is if uh, you got a turbo car, you're here, because like every single one of these cars is turbo. So it's uh, interesting seeing how everyone's different setup is. But uh, I'm just sitting here riding around. Uh, probably gonna leave here in about an hour and uh, go to hit down Woodward. So I'll uh, check in with you guys then. Hi guys, what's up? Uh, so I am down at on Woodward, uh, cruising down the street right now. So I made it down here, uh, just hanging out with my dad and uh, seeing some old friends. So having a good time. But uh, yeah, uh, I think I'm gonna end it off here. Uh, it's been a productive day. Tomorrow we got roadkill event, and I'm gonna try to film there a little bit. So I'll make another video for you guys, but uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and uh, we'll be seeing you guys in the next one. Peace. Hi guys, so that was the Roadkill Nights video that I've been putting off for months to produce. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I, didn't end up, I did not end up filming anything from here until basically this past week. So, uh, sorry about the long gaps, but like I said, uh, going to first shift and changing my whole setup uh, is really throwing me off. So, I've had a hard time filling, figuring out where I'm going to film and edit now because uh, I used to do all my editing at work and uh, it's uh, kind of difficult to do it at home because I'm always busy when I'm at home. So, uh, not that I'm not busy at work, but well, especially now, I'm definitely busy at work, but uh, back in the day, I didn't used to be. So. Uh, anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, the next one should be coming out soon. I think I'm going to go ahead and get this edit get the next one edited up so I can release it next week. So uh, be on the lookout for the video next week. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching, and you guys have a great day. Peace.